In this video, we are going to show the new perform function of Bone MIDI Translator Pro to perform two separate outgoing actions. With the push of one button on my MIDI controller, I will be both sending a keystroke and turning on an LED on the controller. We will be creating three translators. The first translator will take the incoming MIDI message with an outgoing action of perform with one parameter, which will be the note number. The second translator will use a perform trigger and send a keystroke to the computer. For the third translator, we will again use a perform trigger and send a note on message back to the MIDI controller to turn on the LED. First, we open a new project file and define our incoming and outgoing ports for receiving and sending MIDI messages. Let's give our preset a name. Let's create a translator and give it a name. We use the incoming capture window to capture the desired incoming message while pushing a button on my controller. Set the incoming note number to the variable PP. The outgoing action will be perform. The perform parameter is PP, which is the same as the incoming note. We give the perform name select. We create a new translator and give it a name. The incoming trigger is perform. We don't need the incoming parameter here because the keystroke will not use it. Your outgoing action will be a keystroke. In this case, we will use command A. Now let's create our last translator. We give it a name. The incoming trigger is perform. We use a perform name of select in the incoming parameter PP. The variable PP is our outgoing note number. Now let's see it in action. I open up a log window so that we can see the MIDI messages. I also bring the text window to the front so that we can see the keystroke action happen. And there you go. Thanks for watching, and if you have any questions, reach us at www.bohm.com.